c'est des grands, grands détours. Là. Puis moi, tu es le plus serré, on va te sortir que ça reste. C'est bon, puis c'est chouette. Ah, c'est juste pour moi, c'est ça, Denis. Il faut rien essayer. Well, this is what I'm uh, falling into the bush. Come on, half a mile down the road. Uh, we're moving here. That's right, no, just a little bit of a downhill there. It's pretty, uh, that's pretty flat. Just wanted to show you this part here. See, there's a massive pothole there. And I got a 70 foot trailer. And if I put it over that, man. I'll flip something over like that. So we're coming up to one of the ice bridges that they had to fix with the excavator because it was running over. And uh they just made a bridge with rig mats. That's nice. That's real nice. It's just pretty narrow. My tires are right on the edge of that. Such a long trailer. gone 18 kilometers all night and I'm unhappy I've been trying to get sleep while they've been getting hung up all the time I mean I don't want to say that oh you know they're just getting stuck every five minutes but because I could be next but I mean they are getting stuck every five minutes up here these guys didn't chain down their load properly here and um so their shack is coming off which is no good um and they're busting tires and stuff so that'll be fun and this shack up here they're putting on uh changing out some tires because they're busting and uh so it's a lot of fun under there kind of want us to turn around and head back they say if we keep on going um, then it's kind of at our own risk tough call to make because <laughs> I don't really want to go in there with no support but at the same time like I think I could make it I made the decision to keep on going I uh, grabbed two extra spares I put this chain on here that I didn't really like exactly how they had it. So after uh, 24 hours of fixing tires and uh, figuring out if we're gonna, figuring out if we're gonna actually gonna go down the road and finish the trip and not drop the shacks on the winter road and take them in next year. Um, we decided to keep on going. They brought in some different drivers for um, some, people that, some people that weren't confident. I am going crazy. These guys are getting stuck on every single hill. Right now, I'm going to an astounding 
15 kilometers an hour. Back. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do her. That'll do her. This rock just perfectly in the wrong spot. But it's a big rock. It's pretty high. So that's what uh, eats up your tires because you can't go in the ditch over here. You see guys doing that. And if you go over it, that's high enough that it'll take out your your air. Yikes. You need to wipe off your paws before you get in here. Yeah, they're all dirty. Yeah, look at those things, they're filthy. You're on the seat. I'm up this hill here, completely hung up. I took a speed out of it yet, and I think I just got myself more stuff. So the guy behind me, like all of us took a run out of it, we made it over to Grand Bad, and uh, it just is what it is. This other guy, saw us going over, and he tries idling over, and of course he gets hung up like that. So, uh, I don't feel bad, I'm just going to keep driving. No, I won't, but it's kind of annoying. Thought it was solid. That was a mistake. Oh my gosh. That is rough. Rough, 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 rough. Stay on the beaten path. Doesn't look too bad, but those are not nice. Not nice at all. Starting to flood over. They got it dammed up there, it looks like. Oh dear. Oh, Alright, I gotta put my video camera down and drive here. Well, I have stopped here because this looks like a lot of trouble. Okay, I think I can manage this. I'll, I'll get my right steer in here, and I'll keep the other one up there. And I'll keep my trailer straight. And uh, we'll make it through here. It worked for me. Let's see if it works for Roger. That was tight on that side and tight on this side. And Beauty. You 
you'll see these a lot on the ice road once it all starts to melt. This, you know, goes down a foot and a half, and uh, you know you could bust an axle or something like that. So we threw logs in there. Oh yeah. It was another tire. Now we gotta fix it. All right. This is new wheel number one. tell you what if it's frozen this is good but just in those couple days where it was cold or it was warm this started caving in here and the water runs running through so that will take no time to wash out no time at all you can see how it's all caving in there so this morning we're crossing because it's cold but otherwise it'd be a bad idea but it's just sand it's still just Haven. See, now the tricky part is getting back. Because these ones are full of ice, so that one's definitely the one that's happening. This one doesn't have ice. We can step here. Problem is, this one is pretty far away. And, uh. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Nice. 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 There we go. Look at that, eh? Boom! <laughs> yeah. Cool little bridge, eh? Mmm, this chocolate bar is good. Mmm. Want some? Oh! You actually were gonna eat my chocolate bar. I can't believe you. The moment I put it on video, you're gonna eat my chocolate bar. Unreal. You want some? I can't believe you. That's gross. Now you licked my chocolate bar. I'm supposed to eat this. Oh, I was bluffing, Rosie. Gross. It's all right. I'll still eat it. Where's Rosie? There she is. So Buddy here had some problems with his truck on the way out and you're coming 
about it. So, uh, you can see here in his windshield, that's a problem. And his radiator is also leaking. But that came straight through. This is steel. And uh, this is what came through his windshield. They were pulling and the strap busted. And this thing came shooting like a bullet through here. Hit, went through the windshield, smoked this, deflected, and came and smoked him right in the throat. And you can see right there. And uh, that's a... Uh, that's a scary thing to happen. Yeah. You know? <laughs> and uh, so he says that he wants to go home now, so I don't blame him. <laughs> Nothing but problems this trip, but that's the kind of things that can happen on the ice road here. Never mind that, we've been having problems the entire time. And uh, just now we closed this, uh, this trailer because it can spread apart here. And so we got him unloaded, but he went to close it and we didn't see that the rocks had bent up that piece and so now when he pushed it back together it uh it punctured his air tank so now we have problems more problems it's lots of fun